Hello everyone, in this video let us solve this question. So we have 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 4 raised to the power t is equal to 512. And here, what to solve for the value of t. So t is your no what to solve for. So the value of t right here. Now to solve this, write solution. Solution. So the question is 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 4 raised to the power t is equal to 512. So looking at this, what we have is an exponential equation. So we can express 512 as 512 can be written as 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. If you multiply this, what you will get is 512. So therefore, 512 is equal to 2 raised to power 9. 2 in 9 places. So in replace of 512, we'll bring in 2 raised to power 9. So this then becomes 2 raised to power 3 raised to power 4 raised to power t is equal to 2 raised to power 9. So with this, applying the rule of indices that if you have a raised to power b equals a raised to power c, since they have the same base, the same base, right? We can simply compare the exponents just that b is equal to c so applying the same rule right here we have the same base 2 2 we can simply compare the exponents shows that this then becomes we have it as 3 raised to power 4 raised to power t is equal to 9 so with this the next thing for us to do is to express 9 9 can be written as 3 times 3. And 3 times 3 is same thing as 3 squared. So 3 squared is 9. So in replace of 9, you can bring in 3 squared. So that this becomes 3 raised to the power 4 raised to the power t is equal to 3 squared. Okay. And then applying the rule of indices that you have a raised to the power b equals a raised to the power c. Since they have the same base, the same base, right? We can simply compare the exponent b equals to c. So from here, we're having the same base, 3, 3. We can simply compare the exponent. Just that 4 raised to the power t is equal to 2. Good. So with this, 4, 4 can be written as 2 times 2, which equals 2 raised to the power 2. So 4 is equal to 2 squared. So in replace of 4, we can bring in 2 squared. So in brackets, 2 squared to replace 4, then power of t is equal to 2. Then applying this principle of indices, that if you have a raised to power b, power of c, this equals a raised to power b times c. Applying this principle right here, okay, base 2, then power 2, we multiply t, so 2 times t is 2t is equal to 2. So with this, also applying this rule, that if you have a raised to power b equals a raised to power c, the same base, compare the exponent, b is equal to c. So the same base, but then the power of 2 right here is 1. 2 power of 1 is same thing as 2. So since we have the same base, you can simply compare the exponent, such that 2t is equal to 1. So from here, to then solve for t, divide both sides by 2 over 2, 2 we divide 2, the value of t is equal to 1 over 2. So with this, we have gotten the solution for the value of t as 1 over 2. But then let us check whether the solution of t as 1 over 2 is the correct solution. So let's check back to the question, which is 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 4 raised to the power t is equal to 512. So from here, that the question is 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 4 raised to the power t is equal to 512. So let us check. Okay. And we got the value of t to equal 1 over 2, right? So in putting the value of t into this equation, this then becomes 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 4. Then power t becomes 1 over 2 is equal to 512. So with this equal 512 question mark. So from here, once you see something like this, right, 
To simplify this, you first of all start with the, these first two powers right here, which is 4 raised to power 1 over 2. Now, 4 raised to power 1 over 2 can be written as square root of 4. And the square root of 4 is equal to 2. So therefore, the value of 4 raised to power 1 over 2 is 2. So this then becomes, we have it as 2 raised to power 3. Then the value of this is 2. So power of 2 with this equal 5, 1, 2, question mark. So with this, the next thing for us to do is to simplify this value right here, the, the power right here, 3 raised to power 2. Now, 3 raised to the power 2 is equal to 9. Okay, so with this, the value of 3 power of 2 is 9. So this becomes 2 raised to the power 9 with this equal 5, 1, 2, question mark. So from here, 2 power of 9 is 2 in 9 places. 2 times 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 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now, if you multiply this, what you will get as the final answer, okay, for the value of 2 power of 9 is 5, 1, 2. And this is also equal to 5, 1, 2. So that means that the value of t that we got as 1 over 2 is the correct solution. So from here, t is equal to 1 over 2. And this is the correct solution for the value of t in this equation so with this ladies and gentlemen don't forget to subscribe to this channel thanks for watching see you in the next video bye